Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby, your daily call to prayer. Pray with us every day right here on the podcast and in your inbox. Learn more at morningoffering.com. Greetings, friends. Welcome to the Morning Offering with Father Kirby. Today is Saturday, April 27th, and today I'd like to talk about boredom versus peace. But first, let's pray together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. O oh, Jesus, through the Immaculate Heart of Mary, I offer you my prayers, works, joys, and sufferings of this day for all the intentions of your Sacred Heart in union with the Holy Sacrifice of the Mass throughout the world for the salvation of souls, the reparation of sins, the reunion of all Christians, and in particular for the intentions of the Holy Father this month. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. So friends, we live in such a fast-paced world. We always have multiple things going on. Uh, multitasking is is praised as as some type of pseudo virtue. There's always something going on. We're always in a hurry. There's always this push. Go 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 go. And so when we find ourselves not having something to do, well, then we get frustrated and we say things like, "Well, I'm bored. I'm bored." It means there's nothing compelling my attention, nothing that is being expected of me, nothing that I have to do. I find no pleasure or enjoyment from what is going on in this this state of inertia now that I somehow find myself in. And people use this term a lot. I'm bored. It's like, that's like the worst thing in the world. It's like, oh no, you're bored, right? But here's my challenge. I think what happens is oftentimes we've gotten so used to being such in, in such a hurry and in, in such a fast-paced world that we, we've allowed this to happen to ourselves that so oftentimes what happens is we, we've forgotten peace. Like, what, what is peace? Peace is a satisfaction of our souls. Peace means that we can just be with ourselves quietly, be in the presence of God, to have nothing else to do, nothing that's being demanded of us, no mental energy that has to be exerted, And we can simply be quiet in tranquility with ourselves. That's actually a powerful gift. (laughs) And so oftentimes I think when some people have peace, well, because they're so worried about this drama and this pace that they describe that gift of peace as bored. Well, that's just, that's boredom. No, that's, that's terrible. We're not supposed to have that. Well, if we're not allowing ourselves to have peace, then there's always going to be tension. There's always going to be some type of chaos. There's always going to be something that we think has to be fixed. We have to slow down, friends. We have to understand the gift of peace. And to understand sometimes when we don't have things that compel us or push us or being demanded of us, it's not that we're being in a state of boredom. It's that we're being given the gift of peace. And let's enjoy that. (laughs) Let's enjoy the times when we don't have so many things going on. Let's come to a certain set, a certain level of, of spiritual satisfaction to just have peace. Again, it's a gift, dear friends, and it's a gift that comes from above. That's a gift from God. So be careful about this boredom claim and instead recognize, appreciate, and value the gift of peace. And those are our thoughts for today, dear friends. I want to thank you for joining me. I encourage you, keep fighting the good fight. And remember, you can receive daily spiritual encouragement sent right to your inbox when you subscribe to The Morning Offering at morningoffering.com. God bless you. Thanks for listening today. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. The Morning Offering with Father Kirby is a production of Good Catholic, the media division of The Catholic Company. For more faith-filled podcasts and videos, visit goodcatholic.com.